winter again. Time just flies by so quickly. So let's take a look here at what we can look for temperatures as we continue the month of December. Well, as you can see here, it looks like temperatures are going to be cool than normal. But looking at some of the latest forecast guidance over the last couple of days, you can see this color by here on the side. I think we're going to be much cooler than what this map here shows. So maybe temperatures in this green shading, maybe four to five C below normal for the month of December. It looks like it is going to be quite, quite cold and even colder than what I originally thought even a couple days ago. So moving on to our precipitation forecast. Now, this is some good news, by the way. Look at this. I shot at some above average precipitation. And yes, we are going to be talking about snow in the month of December and rain. So hopefully we can get some water into the ground. And again, we are in severe and extreme drought. So this is a good thing to see here on the map. So we haven't really seen a month with above average precipitation for depends on where you are. But most of uh, southern New England, it's been about six to eight months or so. So that is good news. As we move our way into January, look at this. Wow. Look at this cold that's going to be taking over. Almost all of the United States here in the even New England temperatures. Again, this looks like a very cold month. Temperatures three, four, even five C below normal for the month of January to start off the new year. And precipitation, not as above average as December, but this could still change. But right now I see equal chances of above or below average precipitation through the month of January. And finally, as we work our way into the month of February, the last month of meteorological winter, Maybe some more warmer weather, maybe a pattern changes, some things going on with this El Nino, La Nina. So maybe as we work our way into February, we could see a return to above average temperatures in the Northeast as we work our way into February. And finally, precipitation, take it with a grain of salt, but right now maybe some more drier conditions as we work our way into late winter and maybe even early spring. I'm Curry College Chief Weather Forecaster Joe Shacker for CC8. Kelsey, Kelly, back over to you.